Praise the Lord, mighty prophet of the Lord. Amen. Pastor Joanne, the Lord has spoken with me um, this first night, this day, the Lord spoke with me in a very, very uh, profound way and in great detail about uh, the upcoming revival meeting in Ghana. Again, the Lord has spoken with me very clearly about the visitation of the Lord that's coming up in Ghana. And in that conversation, the most of this past night, the Lord took me to Ghana. He was showing me the condition of the church in Ghana. There is a lot of sin in the church. Immorality, false apostles, false prophets, false teachers, false evangelists, false pastors, everything, the whole combination. And most importantly, the Lord has shown me the great visitation that will take place there when he brings his servant to the nation of Ghana. The first mission for this year. And I see a level of healing I've not seen before take place in Ghana. I see a lot of healing, tremendous healing, undescribable healing visitation that will take place when the Lord walks his servant, the mighty prophet, to that land and into that meeting and the healing service. So there is going to be a big visitation and the ignition of revival in Ghana. So revival is coming to the nation of Ghana. The big revival. Yeah, the big, I've, 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 seen, I've probably not seen that type of healing that is going to take place in Ghana. And so the Lord has already marshaled heaven, the resources of heaven, all the missions of the Lord, the delegations of the Lord, are all now focused into the nation of Ghana. And there's going to be a serious visitation there. And that means the Lord is expressing His intent and His blessed objective and purpose at this hour of visiting other nations with this historic revival that Kenya is enjoying. And so, this year is going to be such a profound year, a year of revelation a year of yet another wave across the nations when the Lord will send his servant to prepare the church for the coming of the blessed Messiah, the blessed one of Israel. He is coming. Remember, every single day that passes by draws us closer and closer to the coming of this wonderful Savior, the Redeemer of all men, the Christ the Messiah, the Prince of Peace, the true living bread, the living stone, the corner stone of Zion, the King of Israel. So may those who are in Ghana also now prepare for a very big visitation of Jehovah. And may the Lord bless you as he has blessed Kenya. And for the rest of the world, we have seen what the Lord has used his servant to do from Brazil, essentially to strike the earth yet again with a very serious affliction, the Zika virus. All these help us to understand that the Messiah is coming. And when I was speaking from Brazil, from Rio de Janeiro and then Sao Paulo up the mountain on that open air meeting and saying I see a lot of insects biting them biting them and I said I have entered your rooms I have entered the houses of the Brazilian that have seen all these things happening down there in the houses and now you see and I said trillions and trillions of insects would bite the Brazilians and afflict them. Now you see the soldiers, the army, everybody's going into people's living rooms, bedrooms, bedrooms, 
into the houses trying to spray against this mosquito. Well, uh, time is over. In everything and anything we do today, may we see that the Messiah is coming. Shalom. Thank you.